Hey guys, welcome again. Uh, special Christmas episode. I'm actually recording this on Christmas Eve and I will upload it just after this game is finished, so hopefully it will be good. I want to wish you happy Christmas. If you are not celebrating Christmas because uh, of your religion, happy Hanukkah or whatever you are celebrating. I'm sorry, I'm not really uh, very well known in those religions, but I hope you have special um, time at the end of the year. And Happy New Year going into 2020. Uh, it's been a pretty good year for me. Hopefully it was for you. If it wasn't, hopefully the next one will be better. Uh, that's all the disclaimers. Now let's get back to uh, the game. We have OK rated game here. Uh, I'm playing Babylon. I chose B uh, just because I chose B automatically, but I still would have chosen B, I think. I think we can go heavy into green because the green player is to our left. Uh, but unfortunately, we have nothing here. So it leaves us with either guard tower on just Stumper Yard uh, or trading post, which all are fine. Uh, I think I will go for this, actually. Um, this is a little scary. This is a little scary. I don't know. Kind of confused. And he's the lower related player here, so he's kind of wild card. Of course, he can just be starting and can be an amazing player. Um, for now, I think. Okay. Uh, so now it looks kind of bad. I think I'm switching. I think I'll go for red strat actually. But a red strat in the second era. That will be my, my goal. Uh, of course, right now I will just do this. And this I will use probably for just one set. Uh, and hopefully I can get... Um, I would really like Forum. I would love Forum. Of course, everyone keep red. But I'm actually... I had on red here. I don't remember what was in the last hand. I was so focused on the... Uh, on I don't want to trade here, right? And I don't want to pay. So it's between throwing... and getting two points. And I will actually throw here, because I think that I need gold. This might have been a mistake. If I lose by one, by one point, guys, this is on me. It's always on me, but... Okay, this is perfect. This is what we needed. Now, the plan is to get two red cards as well. One green card. Okay, so this red is not... Yeah, I cannot put this ready. Okay. This is a good green card. Okay, he's actually helping us a lot. But we still need to build this. We are a little short on good things. <laughs> Just because we have only four cards. We are like playing the minimum strat here. And it has its downsides. I would probably like to add some double resource here. Mm, I want it. I will just add points, I guess. Maybe on the last hand. But we are we are in a good position actually. Like uh, this is unusual for me, and I really like this because uh, you've seen me play Babylon a couple of times, and I usually do all the same stuff. We're actually playing this. This is nice. So we'll be the trading Babylon. Okay, this is a decision here, but it really isn't. I have to play this guy because he's much. Well, he's not doing so so well. He can have at most two sets. Oh, 
and I'm actually playing this. I don't need to add red. Like, I have a little trouble with where are my points. And, like, I'm not going green, but I'm sitting next, like, this is not ideal. If the green was here, then I would get all the good cards. As it is right now, I'm not getting them. Um, this hand is coming back to me. I think he, he will pick this, right? He has to. Uh, and then... I don't know, they will be this and this and the red comes back to me. So I can just... Hmm. This is tricky. Another way to do it is just to build the Senate, I guess. I, I think, really, if it comes back to me, then I win red, which is always a plus. Uh, okay. Can I get the second set? I can get one more, one more of this, but I cannot. No, I cannot get the second set. But I can get make it three and five maybe. So this is three at the moment. No, well, this is eight at the moment. But I'm actually building this. So this is better actually. Um, this means that I steal from this guy. Which is my direct opponent, but he can actually build his. Yeah. Okay, he picked that from this hand. That is strange. This is four, this is five, and this is maybe seven. That costs too much. Can he pick this? Uh, this is four, this is five, but costs. I actually, I misplayed. I should have picked fights earlier. I'm actually gonna lose. Yeah. And here we have a bug. <laughs> I actually misplayed. I was so confident on those reds that I forgot that they can actually do these things. And Stefan is still the worst, right? I might still do okay. If, yeah, I lost to this guy. But he had like really great guilds. Uh, he got offered. So it's no shame to, to lose this game, I think. Uh, but it was pretty interesting. I should have actually played one red, I think. But it wouldn't have helped me versus him. Uh, probably. Maybe it would. It's actually hard to say. But just because of how it shaped up. I should have played one red earlier. I was just like, they're gonna ignore red. Because it wasn't any help for them. As you can see, like their scores are very low. Uh, but definitely something to consider in the future. Um, especially when playing against lower rated opponents. And that you... That they push red hard. Because it's it, like it's a lot of points. When I see see this, like he put two red to get from minus two to uh, plus five, so that's seven points, right? So that's three and a half points for cards. Of course, versus uh, his direct opponents, he gained more, but still, like his overall score was pretty pretty bad. Okay, so hopefully you guys enjoy it. Uh, once again, happy Christmas, happy New Year. Uh, spend time with your family. Take care. Bye.